thanks for joining us for week nine of the watch list weevil challenge if you're unsure of what this challenge is go ahead and go down into the description of this video and we've got all the pages and posts linked into the description so i'm going to go ahead and get us started by navigating to my watch list so you do that by clicking the my wiki tree menu and scrolling down to watch list so pam while i show on the screen what we're doing uh, can you explain what is our challenge this week? Okay, our challenge this week has to do with pending merges. So when two different people have created profiles that are the same person, they have to be merged with everybody's approval. So in the middle of the screen there, you can see pending merges. You can also get to this on the find menu on your profile is another way to get to the same place but you will get to this same screen that says showing pending merges in your watch list. And the first thing you want to check is in the middle of the screen, it shows green pending merges initiated by me. So things that I tried to start, what's happened to those? So if we click on that, my list is empty, yay. So if okay. we go back to the ones on my watch list, though, we'll go, we'll see that we have, oh, let's see. There we go. There it is. Okay. So what you're looking for when you come in is you want to see this little yellow band that says you can complete this, which means you started it and either everybody ignored it and the time has expired or the other person has approved it and you can go ahead with it. So you wanna complete this merge if you have that little yellow band. So you're gonna get a comparison, just like you would get um, when you were you know, moving between profiles, and you wanna see if they look like they are indeed the same person. Sometimes people propose stuff that doesn't match at all. So you really do wanna look carefully, even if you initiated it, take another look and see if it is the same person. And if it all seems to match and you're comfortable with it, you merge them using that little button. Okay, so it, has, it says an approved merge. Everybody involved has said it's okay, it can go ahead. So then you wanna be really careful that you're merging the right direction. Sometimes one is unknown and the other one has a, a, a birth name or there's a disagreement between the two profiles about what the correct surname is. I just had somebody merge one backwards the other day. Uh, you wanna be clear, Veleron, if that's how you say this one, is the correct name. If the other one is correct, you would reverse it. So make sure that you're going the direction you want to go and then scroll down through and choose the correct answers. There may be differences between the two profiles. One has a better date. One has an approximate. One has a specific one. And which text do you want to use? Or you can leave that blank and then you can go down and take a look and make choices. But you want to put this together as correctly as you can possibly make it. Once you're happy and everything looks good, and I'm trusting that Azure set this up and she knows it's good, so we're not gonna get into all the, the weeds of it right now, but you can confirm the merge. And you have to be patient and then it will be there. Um, now the second piece of this is sometimes if I merge John Doe with John Doe, it turns out each one had a wife named Mary Doe and we need to see if other profiles in that family need to be merged. So there is a little um, attempt for you to look at a little opportunity to look at the other family members and see if another merge needs to be proposed. So be thorough while you're doing it and get it all the way done. All right, that's great. And as we mentioned on the previous week, um, this one also applies to, if you're interested in doing more of this, 
the Arborist Project, that's their uh, mission is to keep the tree healthy and trimmed back, mm -hmm. back those, mer uh, those duplicates and making one profile out of two. So if you're interested in more about that, check that project page out. And Azure, if you want to take us back to that pending merge page, um, another thing that you might want to look at while you're there is um, merges. You could check and just see if there's a merge while waiting for action by me there on the right hand side. Or you could go into a surname if you have a particular interest in Smith or Robinson or Jones or whatever. You can see what other merges are sitting there that might need some attention and maybe you have the expertise to click on that and complete some other merges that would help everybody. So that's a good thing to do while you're in there. All right. And I if you have questions, this is kind of a new and different thing. Feel free to um, post something in the, in the challenge to ask questions, to ask in G2G, to ask me, whatever will be helpful. Um, this is just such an important thing that we get these merges done so that we can all move forward together on our collaborative tree. All right, that's great. And um, as with the previous weeks, if you have finished your challenge for the week, go ahead, click the link down here for G2G to report what you've done. Uh, and also, you, like uh, Pam mentioned, you can ask for questions, ask questions there about your merges that need done. And everybody will, I'm sure, help you out with that. Um, so thank you, everybody, for tuning in. I did want to just mention that you can follow the tag Watchlist Weevils to get alerted to new G2G posts. Subscribe to our channel on YouTube to be alerted to, to new content. But just tune in each Wednesday at 1030 AM Eastern for the new week's video. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.